All right, guys, I have amazing news. I figured out how to make my videos full screen. So we're going to start out this episode by me pushing my way out of this box and into this full screen setting that I didn't realize I wasn't doing the whole time. So I was told by a friend of mine, you're recording in a box. Um, <laughs> I didn't know what the hell I'm doing. This is all new to me. Everything that we're doing, everything you see, this is all me learning as I go. I appreciate you guys being patient with me while I've done this. I think I'm finally to a point where I'm starting to get it and I'm trying to edit where it's more fun than just stuff happening. So the start of this video, I want to give a huge shout out to my friend Leah over at Gracie's Vintage. It was her birthday last week. I went in to say happy birthday and I decided, you know what, I'm going to do a little tour of the store to show you guys all the amazing stuff that's there. I went through kind of fast, um, but you could see just the amount of goodies that are there. It's insane. So happy birthday to you. I'm going to put her logo up. Um, she's on Instagram, uh, Facebook probably, and tons of other places. I'll try to attach those links. I really haven't learned that process yet, but at least for now, you will be able to see what you're missing out on in the small town of Kingman.
Say bye. Bye. My mother-in-law just passed away a year ago. Did she? So we're going through her estate. Okay. She's got some a lot of a lot of shit. Yeah. Usually. A lot. <laughs> usually the case, right? And yeah. It's really old stuff, you know. Cool. Yeah, I mean, I'm totally down. I'd meet you out there wherever it is. And... Well, it's gonna be right here. Okay. We got. We had to transport it all out. Uh huh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is there stuff in there? Well, my floor is kind of a lot Oh, wow. Well, that's mine, but look at it. Yeah. And there's totes over there. There's totes in my shed. Oh, jeez. <laughs> is this a CD case or something? Yeah. Nice. Okay. Yeah, so this is what we're looking at. Cool. And then, um, anything else? At the moment, no, because okay. I forgot what was in these totes. <laughs> it's yeah. been a year. <laughs> no, it's all good. You know what? You can, uh, like I said, a Monday... If Monday works, I'll come back and maybe by then you'll have a chance to look through more stuff. Oh, a lot of stuff will be out. Okay. Probably still. Um, but I'll keep an eye out. Any in particular? Just yeah, on the back of my card, I got that list. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, yeah, like, as you're getting in and you're like, oh, wait, that was on the list. Just send me a picture or something. That would work. Okay, definitely. Yeah. Oh. And I even came across a couple more, so I threw them in. Did you? Thank you. Yeah. Sorry about the dust, but... No, it's okay. Yeah, I'm looking for uh, Game Boy stuff too, handhelds, you know. Cool. Because uh, we did come across two systems in store yesterday. Um, I'm thinking it was a PlayStation, but I'm not sure. I was going to try to go over there today and get the box that we were looking at. Cool. Yeah, I'd be interested. In basically, almost any gaming stuff. Yeah. Uh, Spinner so. But yeah, I'm so glad I found you because I wanted to get rid of these for a while. Cool. So we're at 50 with this stuff, right? Right. And then 15 with the spoon. Right. So 65. 65. All right. I've... You need any Christmas trees? <laughs> I got three of them. Not at all. <laughs> There's 60, I think. Okay. And then fuck, I have... Did you need change or... Well, if you have it, it'd be better because I don't think I have yeah, five. Yeah, let, let me go get my change. Here's some change for you. Thank 10, you. 20, 25, 30, 35. Perfect. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. I appreciate it. Somebody is a Star Wars fan. How much is the Legos? Five. Five bucks. The shirts. Which shirts are you talking about? These ones? They're five bucks piece. Oh, this is a stay sale, or are you just reselling stuff? No, it's in the stay sale. This came from my house. How about five? Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. What about comic books? I see you have like the. Do you have comics? I used to. Did you? Okay. I have some real old, old comic books. Uh, mm -hmm. But I don't I don't see them even like on eBay or anywhere. Do you want to see them? Sure, yeah. Take a look at them. Sure, Make wherever you room. want. Wherever you want. Here, to go. here's fine. Okay.
easy right there right Great. thank you so much you're welcome thank you would you sell the pepsi yeah how much you asking on it i don't know if you can get it off the wall <laughs> of course i can okay <laughs> i could just use a screwdriver and Pull it out. Yeah, he's going to go get me one. Okay, cool. I'm going to hang it on my wall. If we make a deal, I don't know what you're asking. How much do you want to pay for it? Ten bucks. Fifteen. Okay. Might as well. All right, I don't have anything smaller. That's okay. Charging it. Here's the manual and stuff for that. Oh, that's for a DS. Yeah, that's for that one. I don't have, uh, yeah, so this is what I was telling you. I have this with that in it and that and these and these two games. Mm -hmm. That's all I have for that. And, oh. Well, and then the carrying case, mm -hmm. which you can put the games in. Okay. So, and there's nothing from here on out. Okay, cool. I'm just cool. going through some more stuff. Okay. And then I brought this actual game in over here. Oh, that's the Yeah, I was pouch. charging it. Yeah, I was charging it over there. It's a lot. It is a lot. Yeah. yeah. It's a lot. Do you have a price in mind at all? Mm, I'd like to get a couple hundred out of all of it or thereabouts. Um, I know you have, you resell and, and make money on it and everything. You know, you've got to make money on it as well. Right. I think they're two different ones. But yeah, they are. This is Ocarina. So, yeah, an ocarina. So, Isn't this one worth more than that one? I think so. Even one of this, them, this is the original. Yeah, one of them's worth more than the other. Oh, no, Ocarina of Time. That one's the one that's worth more, I think, because it's and the this gold. This is Majora's, label. Majora's yeah. Mask. Yeah. And I never played this one. Huh. So, and then there's, like I said, two 007s in there. And. Um, can I. Um, so, you're, you're comfortable at 200? Or thereabouts, yeah. What, I mean, what do you... Dad says you're fair. What What would you pay? <laughs> honestly, um, honestly, I would pro I was a little bit more. Yeah. So I'd probably be at like 250. Okay. Uh, I think that would be a little bit more fair on your end and my end. And I would be and happy I would feel with comfortable that. Yeah, there. I'd be happy with that for sure. So the first sale, I kind of went through a whole bunch of games they had. And what I found was um, these were probably the best games out of all. There was a good amount of games total, but 
These are the ones I wanted to highlight the most. What I found was the GameCube, Resident Evil 2, uh, Resident Evil 4, Def Jam, Fight for New York, and the Silent Hill Homecoming. I'll put up the comps for those. Those are turned out to be the best, I would say, overall value-wise. Um, the rest were just a lot of common games, but they were still good inventory pieces. Next, I ended up buying these comic books. These were my favorite of the most. I'll show you individually what they look like. Um, I'll try to put up a comp with it. The glare is kind of bad. Marvel Collector's item. Here comes Daredevil number 41. Amazing Spider-Man number 51. I guess this is the first cover of Kingpin. The X-Men number 46. And Fantastic Four number 84. This one seemed to be in the best condition. After I ended up buying a bunch of games, I got a call from a lady. I ended up buying these boxed N64 games. So we got Star Wars Shadow of the Empire, Super Mario 64, Diddy Kong Racing, Zelda Ocarina of Time, and Cruisin' USA. So those are the ones I wanted to highlight the most. Those are actually probably gonna go in my personal collection, but as well as these most likely. These will be for sale, but just wanted to kind of show you some of the highlighted pieces that I really enjoyed. So with that being said, I just really want to thank you guys for sticking through it and watching and continuing to support me as I learn what I'm doing with YouTube because I really, this editing has just been crazy. So thank you all. I mean, like from the bottom of my heart, thank you so much. And uh, I'll be back with another one, hopefully as soon as possible. So Thank you again and take care. Peace.